My name is Abhimanyu, a former music journalist, an independent filmmaker and a rolling stone. When I was growing up in India, I knew the sound of American rock, English rock and even German rock. But I wondered, where was Indian rock? This is the story of rock in India. The 1950s would probably be the first generation of Indian independent musicians. That's how it started from the, uh, from the late uh, 50s and the 60s. And then in 1983, Tracy Chapman and all these people performed at India Gate. Jesus Christ Superstar is a big chapter in my life. Uh, I had no clue that I was going to be in it. Take me away! Roots is about your hometown, it's about you sing about your mom and dad, about your heartaches, about your aspirations, about your faith. It's sentimental music, it's music with a lot of melody. My entire family uh, gave me up because I used to walk bare feet, I used to just have a pajama and a ganji with a lot of beads around. Millennium. None of us come from wealthy backgrounds where we didn't have to work. All of us worked for a living. None of us inherited anything. None of us had some amazing uh, background where we could afford to say, oh, it's okay. Musicians would like to do independent projects as well because as you get a lot of credibility from that. But I feel that Hindi film has benefited a lot by, from rock. 